honestly think this might be the most powerful local AI setup ever built. We have these big, amazing monsters, but the biggest issue we had last time was networking, the bandwidth. But first we have to actually connect them, right? That's the whole clustering part. Now to make this work, I had to connect them via Thunderbolt and Ethernet. Thankfully, I had a spare Unify switch that has some two and a half gig ports, which I desperately needed because downloading these models, they're huge. The largest one I had to download was 735 gigabytes, and I had to download that on each of the Macs. I also had to make sure my uplink was 10 gigabit Ethernet because goodness, this took forever. We're also using the Ethernet so the cluster can see each other, but it's not how they're actually connecting and exchanging information. That's where Thunderbolt comes in. I was given this very fancy diagram to connect them just so in a mesh. It's just a little meshy. Isn't this beautiful? I honestly think this might be the most powerful local AI setup ever built. Prove me wrong. What can beat 320 GPU cores, two terabytes of unified memory? This cluster should be able to handle anything. And notice our asterisk here, should because it really doesn't matter how powerful these Macs are if the connection between them isn't super fast. And that's what killed it last time, the networking. Running bigger models didn't matter because everything came down to a crawl. And even though we're doubling our bandwidth with Thunderbolt 5, we still have a massive networking problem, latency. But Apple changed the game completely with the software update. 